All right, um, we're back here with uh, Mr. Jeremy Lee and uh, Mr. Kenneth Mack um, from Nexus Card. Uh, we're talking about um, the different types of uh, DDoS mitigation, um, I guess, uh, methods mm -hmm. and the different uh, types of attacks that uh, entail uh, um, pro uh, mitigation, right? So we're here um, talking about, we, we talked about DNS earlier, right? Yeah. So. Right now, what we want to ask you is, uh, what are the ways to mitigate uh, in case of uh, layers three and layer four attacks? Okay, um, the technique to using the um, to mitigate the layer three and four is uh, there's a two 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 uh, two approaches. The the most common approach is using the BGP leverage of BGP routing announcement, mm -hmm. right? So what we do is uh, all the customer side they build up the GLE tunnels to mm -hmm. our scramble center. Mm -hmm. So what does it mean is uh, once they build up the GRE tunnels, right, mm -hmm. and we will enlarge their sublet under protection mm -hmm. from our scramble center. So what does it mean is, what does it mean is all the traffic instead of go direct to the customer site, it will go to our mitigation center first. Right, okay. that's the way we're doing it because what we're doing is we need to make sure the traffic are mm -hmm. Okay. We train mm -hmm. our mitigation center first, mm -hmm. then we can have a capability to leverage our intelligent engines mm -hmm. to do all the mitigation. After we do the, all the mitigation or filtering or whatever mm -hmm. you want to call, mm -hmm. we just we pass the clean traffic through the rebuild the GRE tunnel mm -hmm. back to the segment or the sublet under protection. Okay. okay. So I guess what we need to explain to, to the viewer is What's the difference between uh, this uh, Jerry tunneling and uh, or BGP routing? What's the difference between that and and uh, the the proxy um, type of uh, mitigation like the, the DNS? Um, how how do I know that what I need is Jerry tunnels and not just the simple the uh, yeah or the right DNS right. Uh, protection? Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> your question is a uh, mix up. Sorry. Oh really? Sorry, sorry. Your, sorry. your question sorry. is mixed up with the, the DNS. DNS is an application. It's ah, like one of the application. Okay. Now we talk about the, the GLE is... Uh, OSI layer. Huh? The base on the OSI yeah, layer. Yeah, this is based on the layer 3 and 4. Okay. It's based on layer 3 and 4 because yeah. uh, what, what happened is uh, when there's a segment, for example, uh, for example, if a customer, if a customer, what we talk mm -hmm. about the, the kin pipe, yes, the kin pipe, yeah. the kin pipe, right? Mm -hmm. They may, they they may have a various of application running on this uh, sublet, uh -huh. right? Today they have application one two three four five, mm -hmm. right? And t and the week after, the week after they may change, they may add another application six five six to ten on it, so which means that in terms of the application on this particular segment under protection mm. will change it all the time. Ah, okay. okay. So you don't uh, really... Because mm. what my question was, if I was a customer, if, if I was a business and um, and I'm being attacked and I don't know the first thing about DDoS attacks, mm -hmm. um, and how do I know what to subscribe to? Mm -hmm. So basically, I think I, 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 the first way to doing it is yeah. because uh, Nowadays, as uh, there may be, you you may have a lot of application running mm -hmm. on top of this mm -hmm. uh, segment under protection. Mm -hmm. The best way is to make sure you you protect your uh, using the layer three and, and four protection. Okay. Layer three and four, which is on the TCP layer, okay. TCP, UDP, and uh, and IP layer uh -huh. for the protection first, mm -hmm. right? The reason why is this because your application will be various all the time. Okay. okay? So so make sure, and, and the purpose of the the the, the the main purpose of the layer three and four mm -hmm. mitigation is to prevent and correct road damage. Okay. Example, okay. example, if your internet length is about 100 meg, mm -hmm. right? Now, as of today, I can, if what happened is if I can launch a mm -hmm. one gig of traffic mm -hmm. to your internet link, existing internet link, it will fully congested. Yeah. What does it mean is, no matter what, all your applicant, all all your application cannot run. Yes. Right. Correct. So, so what does it mean is, your availability of your application is almost like zero. Yeah. Right. Okay. So, for when you subscribe to the layer three and four mitigation, mm -hmm. yes, we will do all the all the mitigation. The Nexus Card will do all the mitigation mm -hmm. and make sure only the clean traffic from the layer layer three and four perspective will pass the clean traffic 
to your to your level. Okay. And so okay. what so what happened if it's someone launch a one gig of attack, mm -hmm. right? We do the mitigation mm -hmm. and only pass the keen traffic. So what will be availability? Your availability mm -hmm. will be not hundred percent for sure, but but will but, but will be yeah. sustainable. So yes. which which means the approach is to provide you a when you have a collateral damage, yeah. So which means right. your service is still available, but with certain, certain, uh, certain, uh, degraded, mm -hmm. but it's still available. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's better than do. not having your site up and running. No, right? but right. of course, uh, yeah. because our experience, mm -hmm. we already understand, and because uh, we leverage the intelligence of our engine, mm -hmm. we 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 will keep your we will we will have a prevent your collateral damage and make sure. You have the full availability on the sublet under protection. Okay. That is the way we do it. The layer three and therefore mitigation. Nice. If someone say, "Oh, I can," um, without understand your application, I uh, I can without all the baselining, I can I can provide you, uh, with you yeah. with the layer three and four yeah. protection, okay. hundred percent clean traffic. That's a lie. So that, that is, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's true. Because if you don't understand that we we don't have the visibility. And we don't yeah. have any baseline. <laughs> if they can say, oh, I can protect you yeah. in 100%. Which yeah. is why baselining is very important. Yes, right? the baseline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay, okay. Yeah. If you like what you've seen, you may also watch our previous Think Out Cloud episode. Go to www.thinkoutcloud.ph and share it to your friends.